Hi, I'm Karen Kaiser, your state senator from the 33rd Legislative District and chair of the Senate Health and Long-Term Care Committee. Well, we worked fast and furiously this last week to pass bills out of the Senate before the cutoff. I am pleased that some very important bills have won enough votes to go over to the House for consideration. First, we passed a groundbreaking consumer protection bill for homeowners. Senate Bill 5895 will make contractors accountable for shoddy workmanship. Many families who've spent their life savings to build a house are devastated to find that their contractor wasn't honest and that their home is actually unlivable. The bill will give homeowners a four-year window to seek compensation if their home was built with substandard materials or construction practices. Another groundbreaking bill passed by the Senate is the Domestic Partnership Bill that gives gay and lesbian couples legal rights. Senate Bill 5688 extends legal rights to partners for such things as the use of sick leave to care for a partner and the right to unpaid wages and benefits in the event of a partner's death. These rights will put Washington's domestic partnership law very close to full equality. I was very happy that the debate on the Senate floor was civil and respectful. This issue has made much progress since I arrived in Olympia. I was also very happy in these last few days to send to the House three bills that I consider to be a solid foundation for health care reform. Senate Bill 5945 creates the Washington Health Partnership, and it will work with the Obama administration to achieve more funding for the basic health plan, for children's health care, and for family planning services. And the bill also sets a nine-month process in place to partner with the federal government to undertake comprehensive health care reform for all Washingtonians. Another part of this health care reform effort includes Senate Bill 5501 to set up a secure health information exchange. It will help patients and providers accurately find vital medical records with information on things like allergies, prescriptions, lab results, and scanning results. And finally, Senate Bill 5346, My Healthcare Efficiencies Act, will help reduce waste, bureaucracy, and duplication in healthcare administration. Since we spend about 30 cents of our precious healthcare dollars on administration, these bills will be very important in our effort to reduce costs. Now, our full attention will turn to the budget, and I am working on ways to protect as many health care services as we can, from the basic health plan to adult day services. I hope you have a good week, and as always, feel free to contact me or my staff if you have any questions or concerns. Thanks for watching.